Sup guys, it's the 80 Ninja here. I'm here to bring you another Minecraft modding tutorial. This is number 10. And here I'm going to show you how to install audio mod because this is uh, I'm also going to show you how to add sounds. And in my next tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add mobs. So, uh, well, let's get started. So to install audio mod, it's pretty much very similar to Mod Loader, but I want to do it just in case you don't know. So I have a Mac, so I have to use the Mac way. So I have to go... Um, if you go into Mod Loader, you, you install Audio Mod pretty much the same way. So you do that for Windows. I have a Mac, so I'm going to do this. I'm just going to copy that and paste that because I'm lazy. I'm just going to go BAM. I'm going to go New Finder Window, and I'm just going to go into my MCTMP. And what you do is you take your Mod Loader. You go in here, you go Command A. Plonk everything in there, replace and then you close that and that can then be deleted and then you go into your audio mod you put in that class, you replace it yes you go IVXM and you replace all those um, I remember some people just put the IVXM straight in there if that works for you that's fine but it's never worked for me so I just usually drag all the classes in there rather than the folders and same here, pulse, code, sound, codex, don't drag the whole f uh, folder in um, unless you know it works, but for me it doesn't, so pulse, code, sound, codex, and you're just going to drag that in right there, yeah? And now you can go back, 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 uh, back into your MCT, and you can then close this, you can now close audio mod, you can empty that trash, and now you can copy this piece of code, you go command copy and you go command paste and voila so now if you go to your minecraft, um, mine's in library application support minecraft I don't know where yours is, if you have a windows or a mac or anything so if you go bin here and now you have your minecraft address, what I suggest you do is you run minecraft before you put it in your mctmp, this is simply because when you have audio mod installed um, it generates folders in the resources folder which allow you to put sounds in it but it's best for you to generate them first and then so just wait till it starts making sense so it's generating the folders now you see I'm not make there's no sound coming out of it I don't know if you can hear I can't hear anything but um, as soon as the sound starts working again on Minecraft then you know it's generated those folders but until then please do so um, uh, with me, with MCTMP, if, um, sorry, not MC, with MCP, with Minecraft Coder Pack, what would happen is, okay, there goes, making some sounds. What would happen is it wouldn't generate the folders, and then it would say it it could not it could not find the file, and then when I try to put my sounds in, stuff happens, uh, stuff happened, and it didn't work for some reason. Okay, so we've done that. Now we've still got our old MCP. And we still got all our sources and stuff. Now we don't want to actually destroy our sources. We want to keep our mod underscore and our other uh, block thing. So what we do is we just drag them out here. And I think block test block or something. I don't know. Um, I think we, yeah, block all storage or no. Is that it? I'm not sure. Okay, just hold on a sec. Let's find out here. Um, equals new block, new items. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Okay, here we go. Here's where we may call our uh, Amazon and stuff. Item, new item, new item X, new item uh, da da da. I think it's with our blocks. Yeah, new block Amazon. Okay, there we go. So we want to look for block Amazonites. And we also want to take our uh, Enum tool material out as well. Alright, so now we've got those three out. We're going to drag those back in when we get our MCP running again. So what we do is we go back to... Uh, go back, 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 and uh, back. And we go into our sources. And you open up terminal or whatever you use to run it. And you just go... CD, I have to locate it, so I go CD, I drag in the location, I go bash, 
and I go clean up. And now it's gonna clean up. Uh, hopefully. No such file or directory. Okay, let's retry that. Bash cleanup. No such file or directory. Okay, cd. Oh, it's uh, going to this. cd mcp. Now, if we go bash cleanup, it'll work. And voila. And just type in yes. So this is basically just setting up your MCP, uh, installing audio mod, so this is what you have to go through and I want to do it because I'm going on holiday soon guys and unfortunately I won't be able to make tutorials for the next week and then after that it's another four days and then I've got school and I'm probably going to be able to make tutorials only like once every one or two weeks so I don't want to get your hopes up because m making mobs is going to take a few tutorials and I don't want to go halfway, stop for the next three weeks and then only come back onto it because that'll get me lost, it might get you lost, so I'd rather show you how to set it up first. So, we've got this done, so we can uh, leave it there for now. So if we go into our jars, we see we've got all these, delete them all, except, be careful now, server.properties, leave that in there, okay? So you can delete that all, I like emptying my trash before. And now what we want to do is we want to go another finder window, so we go command N for new and we just make this a bit smaller and I go to my Minecraft library application support Minecraft I don't know if you can see this but I'm pretty sure you know where your Minecraft folders and everything is so you now, uh, if you look in your resources actually just quickly if you see mod see it's now got all the mod it's got um, all the sounds you'll want for making a mod so yeah there we go that's what happens when uh, you run it first so you take your binning resources, you copy them or you drag them in, and you go paste, and you paste them both in there. And then you can close this up, and now you can, uh, it says update, so I'll go bash update mcp, and I'll go yes, uh, I don't think I've updated it in a while, so there we go. And now you want to go bash again, you go bash decompile. And I hope I don't get any errors. I uh, will have to restart this if I get an error, so uh, hopes up. And it takes a short while, so just, you know, sit back, relax. I might fast forward this actually. Or not. It's, it's, a, it's going fine. And uh, we don't need server stuff yet, because so, I don't know how to make server. Um, I've actually realized that what you use to make server mods, apparently it's about sending packets and stuff. If you look, if you like, uh, scroll through the MCP and you see stuff called packets, like packet 1, packet 50, is like 200 of them. Yeah, it's basically just sending packets to the actual Minecraft and, like, sending them back or something. And you don't actually need, um, the server to have the mod, or you might. I don't know, um, I, I still haven't tested it yet, but I, I will, because I do want to show you guys server mods as well. Okay, so it's finished there, we can close that, and we can now go source, minecraft net, minecraft source, and we can now drag this stuff back in, and we can replace our enum tool material. So there we go. And we're done with that. So now what we can do is we can close that, and we can uh, quit that, and we can open up our Eclipse. And you want to select the workspace, so users, your name, desktop, MCP, this is actually my mom's name. Um, yeah, so there we go. <laughs> it's not my name. And here we go, we've got our blocks again. And voila, you see? So if we go clients, sources, network of sources. And I don't think you get any extra classes. It's just there now. And so there we go guys, that's your tutorial on how to set up audio mod and mod loader, okay? And um, the next tutorial I make might be a while, it might be very soon, I don't know, it depends on uh, how quick I feel like doing these tutorials. And uh, yeah, I'll be showing you how to make your own entity for the mob, then I'll do the model and uh, the render and yeah, and then we'll see what happens. So. 
Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you next tutorial. And I know this uh, this 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 doesn't teach you much coding, but um, just just hold on, guys. Yeah, I'll see you next time. Yeah, bye.